Number one, and if she's one over here versus on Q, actually this is a replay of New on Newkirk District. I made a while back ago, and all and unfortunately, the uh, audio lagged pretty heavily. So I'm hoping it doesn't do this this time. Huh, <laughs> that's funny. So here we go, and just kind of show you from my point of view. Uh, now, so, get the pylon on nine. Right. So. so here we go. <coughs> well, while this is um, okay, we on twelve. We'll put this on. Kind of see where everything is at as far as everything else. So. I was talking to uh, one man, um, one of the officers of Next Gen Gaming, which is the team I'm a part of, and uh, a couple announcements to make, and then right, right into the game, since it's kind of a slow start in TVP. So, uh, first off, I'd like to introduce the two new members. Um, one is Ali. She plays she is in, uh, in Platinum as Protoss and she also plays uh, League I think he met her in League so and they started talking and the next one is Graydon and he's also and he also plays League of Legends so we do have two new members there I'd like to say welcome and then on to the um, other stuff so they so I did find out there is a website that they do have called nextgengaming.org. I'll have that posted in the description below so that we can find uh, find more about it. Uh, uh, the website itself is uh, has uh, probably needs a little more tweaks to it but you know as of now um, between the three of us uh, I think we're all kind of busy especially with the uh, two of them being in school and <laughs> so and me so far, I think I'm the oldest <laughs> member of the team. And uh, if you wanna join join the team, whether or not you play, doesn't no matter whether you play uh, League of Legends or you play StarCraft Two. Um, we are open to anybody that wants to join. Uh, all you gotta do is just uh, register in the forums, and then you're part of the team. It's as easy as that. And all you gotta do is just, you know, once you register, um, to make it easier, what games you play, so that way we can kind of figure out, okay. And if you're in lower leagues, um, as myself, I am in gold, and then I got two, mar and then on top of the one new member is in platinum, and then I, the other officer, Kale, is also in platinum, and then one man is also, is, um, is a uh, mid masters so we can all give you kind of we can all help you out and get you to a point where you're actually doing really good so your skill will always be encouraged to go so we're gonna help you with that so but i think that's about it um one man is starting an a team for league of legends so the more we can get in, get more people we can get onto that, uh, the better. Um, we're actually going to start releasing a certain video schedule on my channel. Um, I don't think he, they have started their own. But for now, um, it's primarily going to be StarCraft 2. Uh, we talked about, you know, he, one man talked about wanting to have, a, as we could see, a warp prism on the way. Um, we also talked about having a, um, trying to get, you know, a couple of league games. Uh, I'm thinking of trying to post one a week while keeping the StarCraft 2 content kind of high. So, and that's pretty much about, you know, about that. So, 
so and we're gonna try to do more replays and more games uh, we all talked about with at least three of us for now and probably add in a little more as the war prison harassment uh, died in its tracks and it didn't really take Terran out of it uh, in the game as you see plus one for me is on the way Colossus tech is on the way so and here comes me heavily investing in, in Colossus tech so as you see the stalker will die my opponent is 1-1 one, one. Uh, we see that there is two drops coming in so let's see how this works it was weird because he scans there so it's like oh well I'm sure there's a drop that's going to be happening around that area one meta egg full of units dies and here comes the drop again I lose a cannon there's the stem Lost. I've lost more just because. And the pro to SUV kill, roughly close, so not too bad. Another meta rat goes down, and probably another one full of units. Here comes the streamline of Marines. And so basically, uh, MMM. Stem going down, Guardian Shield going down. Well, let's slow it down just a bit. Um, okay, speed it up again. Nothing's happening. <laughs> I slow down at the wrong moments. So, anyways, uh, this this game itself actually pretty interesting. Oh, uh, there's points in this game where I thought I lost. So here we go. So I snipe his third. Unfortunately, the classes are not firing where they need to be. Um, I'm getting attacked from the back. So the Vikings are doing the damage they need to do. Yeah, I don't think that was a great trade for the Colossus versus um, all those, all the Metamax. Uh, I think he was scouting for a third during this attack. My money is pretty, pretty good anyway. Here comes another attack. Oh no, not the robotic spay. Oh, no. rats! You kill my robotic spay. It's okay. I'll supplement that with several gateways. As you see, there's an attack going here. And I have no one in this gas. Why do I have no one in this gas? Scans are going down. Oh, look, a third. Oh, look, no third. So his third's right back up again he's got another command center on the way as you see I've lost a little less than he has but not by much another drop on the way I just saw it there it is so I'm 2-1 he's 1-1-1 one, one, one. so slow this down again A of these buildings here are actually supposed to slow this down. And then here he comes. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. Wait for it, wait for it. Oh, it all dies. So he couldn't run in because I got a pretty walled off here. <laughs> got more probes kind of chilling out. I got Temple Archives on the way because, you know what? I'm not gonna get Colossi anymore. And if we look at the unit tab, oh, he's got four Vikings, and I think 
he might have one, five Vikings. So he's making pumping out Vikings instead of mostly Metamax. He's got two Metamax on the way as well. And he's in full he's not in full production swing. He's got his fourth down, so he's mining off literally two. He's gonna be starting mining off two and a half bases. I'm actually got to my my two bases, and there we go. Two scans here and here. To see if I've taken any more expansion. I really can't because I'm kind of broke. But what I am supplementing is army, and he's got two two on the way. Mine armor should be done in a second. There's the scan. I don't know why there's a scan there, but sure. Now again, he's gonna do these drops. I'm like, well, okay, he's doing drop. You don't scan certain areas unless you're gonna do drops, so. There's me being supply box. Ah. Uh, that really shouldn't have. There you go. So he's gonna try to run in. Then snipe the robotics. Down goes the medevac. Okay, I'll just make another one. Cannon. Another loss of units. So we're not, he's not really evenly trading out his units. I mean, the drops now are almost not doing any damage because. Look how I have my base. You know, he has to wander around to actually snipe certain buildings. So, let's back up just a bit. Okay, so here's what we missed. So, here's this ball of units. Here's the scan. Here's the stem. Here's the storm. Now he's trying to split his units. Now he's walking his units into the storms. Yep. And now it's sniping medvax. Feedback. Oh, another good feedback down. Oh, that has gotta hurt. So he's got this base finished. So another base going down. I got three high time for not doing anything. Storm's going down on the ramp, which is good because he's funneling his troops, his units on this ramp. PF dies. Storm's doing this significant amount of damage. 18 kills on this immortal, what? Apparently Storm doesn't really affect buildings, so... Try to wait, run away from charge lots. So 
as we see. So we look at the upgrades. He was at 3-2, I was at 3-2. With charge, he was working on weapons. Which this could right here have been an armor upgrade for any of these. So he could have been up four upgrades. Unfortunately, I cut Colossus tech so fast. Once the Vikings come out, you just want to cut that Colossus out anyways. Because by the time you get enough Vi uh, Colossi out to actually do any real more damage, there's going to be enough Vikings to take it all out. And it's like, well, and I had to snipe Vikings. And it's like, well. And then you got to worry about the Marine Marauder Ball that's taking you out. So just easier just to tech the storms. So. I got this there. I got three hard Templar. Not doing a thing. So, and then let's. I think I want to rewind to about. There. So, as, and as you see with the little kind of Sim City like esque right here. He has to wander around to the to snipe buildings. And these two are kind of tucked nicely in the back. I would say give it, the drops were really good. So I haven't, there was no problem with that. I mean, he kept me in my base for quite a while. And allowing him to take more of his uh, part of the map. Now he sees all these Templar, why not get ghosts? I think that was the major thing that didn't see as a ghost. Yeah. Had he had some ghosts, I actually would have lost. Because EMPs would have annihilated there. All my high Templar. I mean, I'd have to do spreads on my high Templar. So he's got six Vikings, which aren't doing anything realistically. He didn't land these, which he should have. He's got one medevac. He, you know, he's got a group of Marines. I storm my zealots because why? Why to give him a small advantage? Now here's where it gets funny: is that look at the streamline of units coming down. Maybe if you pop this down instead and then have them walk, it would have stream or all these down. It's gonna be easier. So I mean his units are just evaporating off. And I still got seven high tempar left and I'm not morphing in anything else. So That I also I pretty much broke the Terran. Just you know, the far mineral wise, he has 400 left. He's mining kind of. He's mining only off of one base now. I'm mining off maybe one, probably about one. <laughs> well, yeah, one. One mining base. Um, I should have took this when I had when uh, once they attacked started to initiate so once I destroyed this ball of units you know as I was chasing them I should have took a probe dropped this expansion started mining from here and that way I, you know at least I'd have production regardless and then drop down a few more gateways so but those are things I could have done the Terran actually did really good I'm not really I'm not I think it was more of a surprise that I won versus a you know, instead of it kind of being like one-sided where you see like uh, every other time. 
So, but I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.